Lil Pump is a rising star in the hip-hop industry. Because of that, a lot of labels want him. DJ Khaled has recently announced on Instagram that there is currently a deal being negotiated to sign Lil Pump to his record label, We The Best Music. Khaled says he's been calling lawyers and telling them to finish up the deal because it's urgent. And perhaps it is. There might be labels trying to steal him away right now that the public doesn't even know about. But from the looks of it, it smells pretty official. DJ Khaled's team has met with Lil Pump's team, so clearly... They are seriously entertaining the idea of him joining We The Best Music. Not everyone has even gotten that far. Just last week, Gucci Mane reached out to Lil Pump on IG telling him to make an offer, to be under his label, 1017 Brick Squad. After that, it's been radio silent. Gucci Mane has been signing quite a few artists as of late, and most of them appear to be purely business, as opposed to artistic preference. Mane revealed his strategy in an interview with XXL Magazine. He said, there's a different sound to some of the stuff that's going on. I'm forcing myself to like it because it's different. He said at the time, it's not what I grew up listening to. It's not what I would generally play in my car. But if everybody else like it, who am I to say that they're stupid or that they're wrong? Yeah, so that's kind of how it ended up. Like, if I keep saying that it's stupid, then that means the next four or five artists that's hot, I don't sign them. So the question is, does DJ Khaled actually like Lil Pump? Or is he just seeing dollar signs like Gucci Man? If we compare the two labels, We The Best Music and 1017 Brick Squad, neither seems to stick out as the obvious choice. DJ Khaled's record label has signed artists like Movado, Steph LaCour, and Vado, none of which are nearly as famous as Khaled. 1017 Brick Squad has signed artists like Waka Flocka Flame, OJ The Juice Man, Chief Keef, Young Thug, Pee Wee Longway, Rallo, Neon Dreams, and Young Scooter, Lil Wap. Waka Flocka Flame and Chief Keef could be considered heavy hitters. However, one could argue that DJ Khaled has more name recognition than even those two, as practically everyone knows who he is. This is partly because DJ Khaled has a reach that expands into the pop genre as well, collaborating with superstars like Justin Bieber and Rihanna. Also, the commercials have definitely helped as well. Have you seen Duplant's campaign with Silk? It's pretty entertaining. Anyway... No matter Lil Pump's choice, the fact of the matter is that he is now free from the vice-like grips of Warner Brothers. They don't own his ass anymore, and that's worth celebrating. Just don't go too heavy on the lean, okay, Lil Pump? Please, like and subscribe for more updates.